Welcome back to News 8 at 11, of course, out here at Lancer Stadium, Eldridge, Iowa, at North Scott High School. Beautiful Lancer Stadium. We're getting set for Assumption and North Scott off part of a big week three of the high school football season. And the score right here on WQED tonight. We're joined now by the athletic director here at, at I almost said Assumption, <laughs> at North Scott, Jason Schroeder. And Jason, obviously you look around and there's a lot new at this place. And I guess we'll start with what is new and what are some of the highlights of, of what you guys have done out here? Yeah, obviously the first thing is the turf. So, yeah. I mean, we've been known for our grass field forever. Um, so my grounds crew today and this past week, they've kind of been off all week. So yeah. they, don't, they don't know what to do with their time. So, they, but they have been doing work, a lot of work around, but yeah. uh, they're not coming out to paint. They're not coming out to put sand down every day, mm -hmm. um, cut the grass. Um, so it's a different world for them right now. They're enjoying it, I think, a little bit. Um, so that's the first big thing we yeah. have. Um, brand new track all the way around. We have painted four by one areas just to kind of spice it up a little mm -hmm. bit. Uh, obviously a brand new home side, around 4,000 seats. Um, two locker rooms underneath, officials' rooms, so they can all be down here. Yeah. Um, a nice air-conditioned press box was Ooh. great. Which we should, go take, we should go take advantage of. That's kind of hot right now. Um, training room, coach's yeah. office, you name it, it's everything. The intent was to keep everything down here and not that we mind walking back to the school, but it was yeah. nice to just come down on Friday night and you're in the building, you're in the facility. Yeah. So this project started after football season ended mm -hmm. last November, October. What was it like to watch it? Was it like waiting for a, a new kid to be born, or just I mean, just I mean, you're just waiting yep. for something. I mean, just be careful, gonna, don't because, compare it to your well, right, right, right. But yeah. I mean, because you see bits and pieces, and yeah. then the springtime comes, and you're like, we're getting close. It was it was a neat process. I mean, they, you know, you started off watching it and looking through, it was like, and they they tore the bleachers down in like a day. I'm like, oh my wow. gosh, mm -hmm. you know, it was it was quite a little longer than that, but you come out every day um, just to look at it and watch everything go into progress. It was neat. I think the the wow factor was, I think around March, um, they start putting the bleachers up, mm. and we're like, oh my gosh, is this too big? I mean, it looks, I mean, you can see it, it's, it's pretty big, and it, it was nice to watch that process. So it's been a lot of fun to enjoy, um, but we're set to go tonight. We're ready to have some fun. It's funny because I think during COVID, we did a stadium series, and we mm -hmm. ranked all the stadiums around, and this one was ranked well, but it wasn't as high, but maybe it would be now. It's always been a great tradition and feel here. How excited is it to kind of have the amenities around you that kind of matches the success of the program, the, the vibe here in Eldridge, and what goes on in North Scott? Yeah, it's been it's been a crazy couple of years, and I mean that in a positive way. Um, to say what we have these past few years, the new softball field, uh, Lancer Athletic Building, upgrades to soccer, and then we got Lancer Stadium here for the athletic side. It's pretty impressive. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I, I would say we have some of the best facilities around, not just in the Quad Cities, but maybe the Midwest. I mean, we, I'll put them up there with anybody. Yeah. So, you know, the great thing that helps it out, you have, like I've always said, our superintendent has been outstanding. He supports not just the athletics, but activities in the classroom. We got a brand new innovation center down the street that is. It, it's it's huge. It's really nice to see, and then you have a school board very supportive of everything we're doing. So um, then you, obviously you have the coaches we have here at North Scott that uh, appreciate everything we have and don't take anything for granted. I mean it's it's a uh, it's like thank you. It's uh it's it's really nice. It's been great. So what's something that maybe the fans are going to enjoy that besides what they see? Mm -hmm. What's something that they're like? Oh, I didn't know they did that as well. Um, well, I think the first thing the moms are going to be happy they don't have to wash muddy uniforms every game. So that's the first <laughs> thing, right? Um, but the neat thing is our stands are, are really high elevated. If you can look at them, they're really high elevated. So you are, you are up there pretty high. Um, so that's kind of the neat things with the wow factor. Um, nice plush red end zones. Um, you know, trying to make it the best we can as a, as a college type of setting. Um, you know, the locker rooms underneath, you know, that's the nice thing for security wise. We kept everybody inside. That was a big thing we wanted to do. Walking back out, you just never know, unfortunately, more these days. Um, but keeping everybody inside the stadium, um, just enjoying it. Um, there's a lot of new, a lot of things not quite done yet. Just like the cosmetics of that stuff, yeah. not quite done, but that'll be done in a couple weeks. Uh, excitement, I know that because you kind of made sure it was week three to make sure everything was done. Mm -hmm. So you had to get those through those first. How exciting is today the vibe around the town, around the building itself? Because people have been pointing to this for a long time, and then to have someone like Assumption, a, 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 a Mac rival, yep. obviously not Mac when it comes to football, but in general a Mac rival. It's got to be exciting today to get here and kind of oh, it's kind of like Christmas morning. Almost. It is. It is. It's been an exciting couple of weeks. I think everybody's been counting down the days for it. Mm -hmm. uh, we have our kind of a pet bottle later today about. Out some things. We had a marching band down the hallways this morning. It's a red out game for us to start the tradition off like each year we do. Um, I think the community's excited. It's going to be, 
the good thing, I think we might not have enough seats tonight. So that's, that's a good problem to have. So it should be a great night. I think the community's ready for it. Well, you mentioned the red out. We are, are applying. We are, we are going <laughs> You're ready to go. We wore the red as well. So, Jason, we always appreciate you stopping yeah. by. Great job with this. Enjoy it. Don't mess it up. Okay? Hey, thanks. We'll try not to. <laughs> awesome, Thank you. Awesome. He's Jason Schroeder, Athletic Director here at North Scott. We still have plenty more to get to out here for Score on the Road. We'll have some more interviews coming up. We'll get you caught up on the weather. And most importantly, we'll get you ready for week three of the high school football season. The score is 40 five minutes long. It's tonight right here on WQAD. We'll be back right after this.